TGIF, welcome to the Beamish Blogcast, March 4th, 2016, wrapping up the work week on a warm note, but starting the upcoming work week a little cooler than normal. 89 this afternoon, partly cloudy skies, two off of the record high set on this date all the way back in 1910, will drop to the mid-50s overnight, and I think that cloud cover will hang tough. Three storm systems off the west coast, this is the one that we are watching for late Monday into Tuesday. We're confident we're going to get a cool down from this. When it comes to rainfall though, a much different story. Latest European model putting the storm track directly over southern Arizona. That would mean good news for our rain chances here in the metro. But the GFS model is putting the storm track well to our south and that would put the best chance of showers and mountain snow along the international border possibly leaving Tucson high and dry. European model plotting out over three tenths of an inch of rain between late Monday night and Tuesday. GFS model barely Barely putting the old Pueblo on the board, so a lot of uncertainty whether we'll get rain or not out of this storm system, thus our rain chances have dropped off versus what I was forecasting yesterday. Here's a look at your forewarn extended forecast. Sunday, the transition day, mostly cloudy, gusty winds during the afternoon hours and dropping into the upper 70s. We put those rain chances now at 20% late Monday night, down from 30% that I had yesterday, and then rain chances on Tuesday, 40%. Those numbers may change, I want to warn you that, because the latest model guidance will be dictating what those precipitation percentages will be at early next week. But again, it will cool down starting off the first half of next week with 60s for highs and then waking up to the upper 30s to low 40s on Tuesday and Wednesday morning. Looks like we'll be making a run at the 80s yet again by Thursday of next week. Quick programming note, I am off on Monday and Tuesday. Make sure to follow meteorologist John Patrick. He'll be on the TV side. Until then, I hope you have a great weekend, and I'll see you today for News 4 Tucson at noon.